Hey, how's it going? In this video, I'm going to uh, answer one of you guys' questions, uh, asking me several things about the, te the testing phase. And uh, let me just answer them, okay? So the, his question is, uh, what countries do you target for your testing phase? Okay, so this one is dependent on your supply chain, but generally you just want to do US first. And then afterwards, um, even for US campaigns, I will separate um, US campaigns and then the top four countries. So if you don't know what I'm talking about, uh, in my mind, tier one countries are uh, the high GDP uh, per capita areas. So it'll be US, UK, Australia, and New Zealand, right? Um, if you're gonna throw in Canada as well, yeah, then probably Canada, okay? So I generally test US and then Canada, Australia, UK, New Zealand, I put it into a separate campaign. Okay, so it uh, usually the data is very, very different, by the way. So um, that's the countries that I usually test for a testing phase. Okay, after launching the initial ad sets, how long do you let them run before you decide to kill or scale? Uh, yes, I give them 72 hours. So like when I launch ad, right, after three, uh, three days, I don't even touch it. The reason why is because like um, you cannot make a decision. If you make a decision before that, right, it's really skewing your data. It's, it's going to mess up your decision making and your understanding of what is actually working. Okay, so that's generally how I see it. Do you give it 72 hours or do you kill it after it spends uh, the break-even uh, KPI without sale? Yes, I run it for 72 hours and only after 72 hours, it's like it doesn't hit that, that break-even uh, KPI. Um, then yes, I will, I will kill. Okay. When do you transition profitable ad sets from the testing phase to the scaling phase? Uh, what is the indicator that the ad set is ready to scale? Okay. How I like to do it is just, um, for, so for example, if, if I was running $100 per day and then on the testing phase after three days, and then I see it gets purchases, right? So it's like, okay, I, I can keep this ad set on. I can keep this campaign on, okay? I'll let it run for probably another two to three days. And then if after two to three days, that is still uh, getting consistent purchase, then I will move it to the scaling phase. So there's obviously an initial 72 hours and after the 72 hours, probably another 72 hours where it can show consistent performance, then I will bring it to scaling. Okay, hopefully that makes sense. And that's because like, uh, time lag and like just making sure that at higher spend uh, that that can can um, what's called the, the the performance can can be consistent as well okay so after after the testing phase you still need to show purchases after a while otherwise if you you, you scale too fast right you don't really know whether it, it, it can um, get the same performance on high spend right so i that's why i always say on asset level right testing even um try to do hundred dollars per day first so that um after the first three days Three day period, right? You probably want to increase the budget uh, by 20, 10 to twenty percent day by day, and then afterwards you move to the scaling phase. Okay, hopefully that answers your question. Okay, um, how often do you test new audiences in your testing campaign? Okay, I test every day. <laughs> I launch every single day. So um, that's that's probably the, the difference between um, people who, who who find I don't know can scale and, and don't. It's just because I, I I think I test them more than you, probably. Right, so um, I, I test every day. And of course, if for example, if your budget per day is like $300 per day, and that's all you can go, that's the max, right? And then obviously, if for example, the first, after 72 hours, uh, one of the, the campaigns die, then you, you turn it off, then you just launch a new one. You need to keep launching. If you don't keep launching, right, you won't have new cold traffic and customers coming in. So that's how you expand the business, right? So that's, that's uh, you just need to keep testing, really. You, just, you need to keep testing every single day. And obviously, if you have the budget, just test like crazy. Just test everything. Okay, uh, that, that's going to make you resistant to, to, to everything else. Okay. Yep. So that's pretty much it. Hopefully that answers your question. Um, yep. If you have any questions, uh, any other questions, please put them down in the comment section below. I will take them and then I will answer those questions and then create a video for you guys to help you guys as well. Okay. Yep. Uh, that's pretty much it.